Markov. Package in hand on move. Welcome to Watch Mojo, and today we're counting down our picks for the best movie fight scenes released since 2020. A blind man, a guy with a dog, and John Wick walk into a bar and take a seat at the table. Number 10, the bus fight. Nobody. It's stupid, hey, right? Guys, guys. What are you still doing here, old man? This action film takes major cues from the John Wick franchise, like sharing lead writer Derek Kolstad. And like John Wick, it was widely praised for its action scenes. The bus fight earned particular acclaim, with Bob Odenkirk's Hutch Mansell taking on a group of goons in the enclosed vehicle. <laughs> Numerous aspects of the fight were praised, including the camera work, editing, and Odenkirk's surprising athleticism. Also of note is the beating that Hutch takes throughout the fight, which is atypical of your usual action hero. It's brutal, it's hard-hitting, and it made Bob Odenkirk, of all people, an action star. <laughs> Number 9. The Killer versus The Brute. The Killer. Stick to your plan. Anticipate, don't improvise. As fun as it is watching macho heroes breeze through the bad guys, it's refreshing to see protagonists actually struggle in their fights. Like Hutch, the killer flounders mightily in his showdown with the brute. He's blindsided by the big guy and is completely manhandled through much of the fight, getting slammed into walls and thrown around like a rag doll. It's not just the nature of the fight that proves interesting. It's also a wonderfully made scene with technical precision, including fun choreography, great stunts, and absolutely brilliant sound design. And come on, who doesn't squirm when the brute, shall we say, lands on the table leg? Number 8. Duel at the Gates of Hell. The Northmen. Acclaimed director Robert Eggers entered the 2020s with The Northmen, a challenging revenge epic influenced by Norse mythology and the story of Amleth. The climactic duel between Amleth and Fjolnir is quite literally the stuff of legend. The two engage in an ancient Scandinavian duel called a Holmgang, and it couldn't be any cooler. The backdrop is startling, taking place at the gates of hell in the crater of a volcano. The sound design and accompanying music aid in the scene's epic grandiosity. And let's not forget the wonderful choreography, which is beautifully displayed in a single unbroken shot. It doesn't get much better than two perfectly chiseled dudes having a sword fight in an active volcano. Number 7. Trial by Combat – The Last Duel Will you swear it before God and all the fronts? I will. Ridley Scott is still bringing the historical bangers, this one based on a true story. It recounts events from 14th century France, when a knight named Jean de Carouge challenged squire Jacques Le Gris to a judicial duel. Then we fight. Marguerite is my wife, and we have been wronged. I will not allow it to go unpunished. It's a brutal fight lasting nearly 10 minutes and is full of medieval goodness, including an exciting joust, lots of shield bashing, and the constant clanging of swords and armor. Much of this fight was exaggerated for the screen, but we can't blame Scott for that. He made an awesome fight, and one that will be remembered for a long time. Maybe not as long as the real fight, but still. God has spoken, proving your cause to be truthful and just. Number 6. The Hong Kong Fight – Godzilla vs. Kong There's one reason people come to a movie called Godzilla vs. Kong. Luckily, the film more than lived up to its promising title with an instant classic of a battle. The two legendary titans duke it out in Hong Kong, and the fight could not be any cooler. It 
Immediately of note is the scene's visual style, with the city lit by gorgeous neon colors that lend a tantalizing atmosphere to the fight. And then, of course, there's the fight itself, which is wonderfully realized through fantastic CGI and breathtaking sound design. This is blockbuster movie making at its best, and it came at a time when everyone needed it most. Number 5. Wayman's Fanny Pack. Everything, everywhere, all at once. Okay, I need you two to get on the ground with your hands behind your heads. Okay, okay, okay. This bizarro film from Daniel Kwan and Daniel Scheinert is not usually the type to win Oscars, but it walked away with seven, including Best Picture. And if there was an Oscar for stunt choreography, they would have gotten that one too. Alpha Waymond opens up a can of you-know-what on a number of guards, using the rather untraditional weapon of a fanny pack. Sir, please comply. The fight is a perfect blend of tones, being suitably brutal and cringe-inducing but still in keeping with the movie's wacky style. It's also technically proficient, with Ki Hui Kwan displaying his real-life mastery of martial arts, having a black belt in Taekwondo. Between this and the Evelyn Jobu fight, the movie packed more than enough high-octane action. Number 4. The Iceberg Lounge, The Batman I want to see the penguin. I don't know what you're talking about, pal. The Caped Crusader got yet another reboot in 2022, this time with Robert Pattinson donning the mask. It was a great iteration of the iconic character, receiving praise for its film noir style and fun action. Perhaps the greatest sequence was the Iceberg Lounge fight, which sees Batman taking on a number of goons inside the Penguin's nightclub. Get out of here, freak. You hear me? That little suit's gonna get all full of blood. Like many action scenes of the 2020s, this one takes huge inspiration from the John Wick franchise, with the nightclub setting, music, and cinematography being highly reminiscent of that series' style. It's a brief fight, but it still satisfies, especially when Batman gets creative with some weapons. Watching Batman whip a baseball bat at some dude's head will never not be funny. Hey, put the bat down or I'll blow your head off! Number 3. The Rue Foyatier, John Wick Chapter 4 Last chance to win the prize before Mr. Wick's last sunrise. This franchise has helped shift the modern landscape of the action genre and it's still showing the kids how it's done. Chapter 4 was widely praised for its action, including killer sequences like the Killer Harkin nightclub fight and the Dragon's Breath apartment shootout. But the pièce de résistance is arguably the fight on the Rue Foyatier. So who out there is going to climb those 222 steps? Keanu Reeves teams up with the legendary Donnie Yen for the skirmish, and both prove why they are the best in the biz. The cinematography and editing are naturally excellent. But what really sells this scene is the poor stuntmen who go head over heels down the stairs. The part where John falls down the entire length of the staircase is just magical. <laughs> Number 2. The Prison Escape, Extraction 2 Don't push me. You're scaring him. Yeah, he's about to be terrified. With the Extraction franchise, Netflix proved that they could play with the big action boys. The first film received praise for its winner, but the sequel upped the ante in every conceivable way with the eye-popping Prison Escape. This is just an absolutely mesmerizing action sequence, featuring strong production values, marvelous camera work, and a dashing Chris Hemsworth proving himself the baddest dude around. Any route to Charlie that isn't through the common yard? Negative, negative. The entire sequence is magnificent, but what's most impressive is the unbroken fight in the prison courtyard. They'll be teaching this in film school in the coming decades, so flawless is its execution. And speaking of execution, how about that dumbbell kill? Brutal. You all right? All right, we're at Charlie, open up. Before we continue, be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. You have the option to be notified for occasional videos or all of them. If you're on your phone, make sure you go into your settings and switch on notifications. Number 1. Raju vs. Beam, Triple R The Indian movie that took the world by storm, Triple R was an unpredictable cultural phenomenon with action scenes that rivaled even the best of Hollywood. 
This is best exemplified by the absolutely ridiculous fight between Raju and Beam. This scene truly has it all, showing off the film's gleefully over-the-top nature in all the best ways possible. <laughs> It starts with Raju sending a flaming chariot wheel into Beam's chest, and only gets sillier from there. Despite the strong emotion stemming from their encounter, the fight is absolutely ludicrous and unbelievably entertaining. Turn your brain off, have some fun, and enjoy the most gonzo fight of the decade. Did any other fight scene have your blood pumping? Let us know in the comments below. You know you owe me. Yeah. Did you enjoy this video? Check out these other clips from WatchMojo. And be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.